Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to my kitchen. It's your favorite cook, Kirby. Now today I'm gonna be making some special pancakes for my wife and kids. They don't know I'm making it, that's why I'm being quiet. So, let's get into the recipe. Okay, so we're gonna be doing this from scratch, so Here's all the ingredients I have. I have one and a half cup of all-purpose flour. We got one egg. Three tablespoons of melted butter. One and one quarter cup of milk. And in this mixture, I have one tablespoon of sugar, one teaspoon of salt, and three and a half teaspoons of baking powder. Okay, so I'm gonna be using my KitchenAid stand mixer. Basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna just go ahead and pour everything in. Okay, you wanna go ahead and set it to low. Excuse the noise from the machine. Go ahead and add in your butter. Add in your egg. Now you want to slowly add in your milk. All right, so we're gonna increase the speed so that way you get everything nice and smooth. Okay, after about two minutes of whisking, you're gonna go ahead and check it. You want it to be nice and, and creamy on the batter. If you don't see any lumps, that means you're good. Uh, this KitchenAid does really good on mixing pretty well. Uh, if you're interested in a KitchenAid, I'll leave a link down in the description. So that way you can pick yourself up one. These are really, really handy in the kitchen. Let me just show you the batter without making a mess here. That's about two minutes on medium speed. Get a better shot there. So yeah, that's two minutes on medium speed. No lumps. If you see any lumps, then you want to just you know give it a little bit more time. Okay, so I have our cast iron griddle set to on low heat. I'm gonna add a little bit of butter just to get everything nice and oily, and then also that butter adds flavor. Okay, so we're gonna be adding our batter to the to the griddle. You wanna take a spoonful and you wanna point the tip of the spoon downwards. That makes the perfect pancake. We're just doing little pancake bites here. Okay, so you're gonna let this cook for roughly about two and a half minutes. Uh, basically what you'll start seeing is the sides kind of firming up and you'll see bubbles coming up from the top of the batter. Uh, once you start seeing a nice, uh, like, a, like a blanch white on the side, that's when you wanna flip it. You can go ahead and test it like about two minutes. Okay, see like this one here? It's, a, it's starting to form up. Uh, you see the difference in the color and you start seeing the bubbles. This one not so much, but this one we're gonna go ahead and give this one a flip. Perfect. Let's see if we can, yeah, we're good on this one. You know, like I said, just a couple minutes on this side, you're looking about a, like about a minute and a half. Um, you just wanna kind of golden brown it. Okay, you just want to make sure that they're golden brown like this one's done. See? 
just like that. Okay, we're gonna just line up our pancakes. We're gonna do about three. My kids love strawberries, so put a couple here and there. And then we're gonna top it off with a little bit of banana. Okay, we're just gonna give it a sprinkle of confection sugar. Okay, so this is the good stuff here. Kids are gonna love this. Well, I hope you liked today's recipe. Thank you so much for watching. Trust me, this recipe is really delicious. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, smash that like button for me. If you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them down in the comment section. Now y'all take care and be beautiful.